Greetings and salutations, friends, and welcome to some Planet Coaster Sandbox with Mr. Adrian. Things are going pretty, pretty okay. My little weird, leany housey thing here is, it's looking okay. It could do with a little more detail work, I think. Maybe bring out uh, an overhang on here. Uh, but we'll figure that out at another time. I threw some more trees and stuff in and around this thing here. It's um, it's the reported trackside scenery was low. No, it still is. Oh, I'm gonna have to put some actual scenery in. Damn. I'm not quite sure what kind of scenery to put in there though. Oh well, whatever. Um, I've done a little bit more work over here, as you can probably tell. Um, I added some more bushes along here just to block line of sight into the winter area. Oh, I need some mics some over here. Um, I swapped out, oh, well, I made the entrance and exit pathway way bigger. It's now a, 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 a full size, what is that, 30 something other feet? It's the, the widest one, I think. What is the widest one? 8 meters or something? 20 meters? I don't know. Uh, but I made the longest one I could. And replace the two trees and put my little sign up and some little snow effect coming down from it. Looks quite nice. Hello. Uh oh. You know what? I need to put a toilet in here. I need to finish off this building. Oops. Uh, I uh, copy and pasted this end of building and slapped it down here just to fill in that gap. Um, I forgot to actually turn off building editing and dump down all the uh, the snow here. Oopsie. Um, I want to do some more stuff in here. Um, not quite sure what I'm going to do in there though. I want to do something. Um, might just fill it in with these square snow blobs and break it up with some uh, some lumps like that. But Apparently, some guests want to use the restroom, so let's uh, let's make that happen for them. Uh, restroom, custom. Oh, for crying out loud! Okay. Um. Oh. I'm actually getting low on room here. Ew. Well, that's it. That's actually a good thing. Uh, where can I put it? Ah, 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 right there. That would work. Okay, I can bung the restroom in right here. Let's lower it down. I just don't want those railings. So, we'll put the restroom there. Hit that done. Standard restroom, 132. There's no way I've got 132 restrooms in this park. Actually, I think I've barely got three. Uh-oh. <laughs> Let's check that, shall we? Uh, where are we? Uh, trucks and, and shops. Facilities. Oh my god, I've got more ATMs than I have restrooms. <sighs> <laughs> Oopsie. All right, well, let's set up our charge for the restroom. It's going to be 20 cents, and I'm going to sink it across the park. And I'm also going to sink up. Okay, these are synced. All right, first aid. Um, we'll sink the first aid across the park as well. This one's never had any guests. Oh, that's because it's all the way over here doing nothing. That's a really stupid place for a restroom. Uh, for a restroom? Raw! For a uh, first aid place. Really, that wants to be like right close to uh, a roller coaster that's got a high nausea rating. So, quite honestly, I should just go ahead and close that one. That way, it's not costing me any money. And again, I know this is on Sandbox, but I'm kind of, I'm trying to keep the idea of. of finances in my noggin so when I start my challenge uh, I'll be used to thinking that way 
You know what I mean? Right, so what are we going to do today? Well, as you notice, I just panned over towards this corner. Um, this corner is very empty. Although, I could do something over here too. Nope, we'll go do it in the other corner over here. I'm going to build myself a measuring stick. Uh, actually, before I do this, sorry about that. Um, so I need at least 30 of these. One. 29. I think I'm going to stop at 29. Right! Holy moly. It's one hell of a lift hill. Oh! Oh, I gave it away. Yes! I think it's time I embarked upon the creation of some way of killing my guests. Or, in other words, a very, very tall roller coaster. We're looking at 29. What's that? and 17 meters or something or other uh, yeah something like that okay so I'm going to build it out over here I, I again I kind of want it out the way <laughs> I do I want it out the way okay we're well, gonna put so we've again. Okay, so if the station is going to be on this hill, put that there. So I need the lift hill to terminate about there. Actually, let's bring it out this side. Like that. Right, that is my measuring stick. I need to get, geez. People are gonna die. I need to get the top of my left hill from the station, which is gonna be in here, above that line. Holy crap! That's huge. I may rethink this. I may take this down by a few meters. I mean, this is forget that. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me grab this here. And this is... Well, okay. It is It is way taller than this one. Good grief. Alright, we might take a couple of... Uh, couple of sticks out of this. This is gonna be absolutely completely friggin' loopy. Okay, that's the tallest... Okay, that's the measurement on that. Let's take this down. Okay. Working. We'll, 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 we'll do it against the ground. I think that's a fair judgment right there, and I'm going to edit this. I don't want to kill anyone. 29, 28, 27. Done. 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 Right. So I need to get to the... See, now that looks way taller than that. Oh, no, because I've got to get over that, so it is going to be... It is going to be a little, a little bit taller. Okay, so next thing to do is to pick my roller coaster. Oh, my God, I'm going to kill people. Um, Since we don't actually have... Oh, you know what? This is going to be... This isn't over a hundred. Did I? How did I... Wait, did I take chunks at this? How did that happen then? I... What? I, eh, er, what's going on? That's really weird.
Okay, that's better. That looks a little... Okay, that looks a little better. Right. Okay. That was kind of strange. What the heck happened there? Was it... Was it hidden by occlusion or something? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Uh, steel coaster. We're going to go with the Giga. Now we've got... What is this one over here? Is this Rage or is this Invincible? That's the Invincible. Do I want the Rage Coaster that freaking tall? I mean, that's pretty open. I could go with a hype now. We'll go with... Screw it. <laughs> not my problem. Well, technically it is my problem. But it's not going to be my problem. It's going to be my guest's problem. So, that's going to be a pretty long lift hill, so we'll put it over here. I'm going to lift it up. Like that. Um, you know, I think, no, yes, maybe so, possibly. Oh, that's way above the station. I mean, that's a, that's a pretty big hike for the guests. Uh, I mean, I do want it to be, like, intimidating. Okay, well... The lift hill is not fixed. I can always, like, move it, I guess. Right. Um, I definitely want to make the station longer. screwed that up, didn't I? I need to... Okay. Okay. No, no, no. Wh who would... Why would you curve up? Okay. Bloody trees. <laughs> Get out of my way. Right. This is going to take a while. It's, oh, crap. I don't want to test it yet. <laughs> yeah. Test the first three meters of the track. That's brilliant. Okay. Can I get this down any lower? I can. I can. Just barely, though. Okay. That now the lift hill. Oh dear God! You know how long this lift hill is going to be. I'm going to put the angle snap on. I mean, I could make it a really steep one. Forty-five meters seems. You know, let's do forty-five meters to start. We'll take it up to sixty. break the chain lift doing this. It won't let me go any closer. There we go. Uh, okay, back a little bit more. Hang on a minute. 
you longer. Nope, we want to go slightly higher than that. I want to get up to about 306. There we go, 364. Yeah, baby. I am going to shorten this up. Oops. Right, are we scared yet? See, this is the thing, is now playing with this track is going to be really tricky. At this height, it, it gets very difficult to get the camera to move the way you want it to. Alright, so... Especially when the whole thing pauses like that. Go on, Frontier. Okay, so... 10, 10 degrees down. Oh, 360. Spot on. Alright, and then from here, things get very, very scary. <laughs> oh, some people are going to die. I don't know if I wanted to go off over this, though. I think what I want to do is get it to come across this corner here. So I'm going to take that back. Angle at that, like that. And now I can stretch this out like this. Now you know what? Let's make the first one a short. There we go, we'll make this one a nice long one. Does 80 degrees sound good to you? That sounds freaking terrifying to me. Let's bring on the angle snap. I just want to make sure that I'm not actually still in a corner. Okay. Okay. Now we're going to want to start straightening her out because if she's picking up a lot of speed when I turn her upwards I don't want to break everybody's necks like that. Hang on. Oi. Trees again. want this to go under the you know what I do I want this to go under the monorail before it starts its, its turn that's probably too much to be honest what is that six feet nope I want it lower than that um, I'm going to delete that. Oh, you know what? I could just turn on auto tunnel. <laughs> oh dear. So I can come down a little bit more. Zero meters, wasn't it? Okay. Twenty degrees might be a little bit on the sharp side. Well, we'll run test in a minute and find out how badly this is gonna kill everyone. <laughs> G-force loads. Okay, 
75 meters up. So we start at 160 meters. So we should be able to get pretty high with our first. Uh, 160 meters. 360 feet or something around there. Okay, so let's. I'm going for a. I'm going to do something really weird. <laughs> um, I am going to end this right here and I'm going to test it. Um, I want to find out what is going on with the, uh, the, the forces, the, the loads and all the rest of that stuff. I want to make sure that this is okay and that I'm getting um, air off of this before I continue developing this coaster anymore because this is going to get really out of hand really quickly. <laughs> and I know that if I don't tune the start properly, it's going to be really difficult to tune the whole coaster. Um, so what I'm going to do, uh, I need to go into here. If I take, there we go. If I do nine cars per train, I can run two trains. Now, remember what I've said before, if your train uh, comes to a, is waiting in the station, like if this one isn't full, this one gets back to the station and pulls in behind this one, this doesn't count against your, uh, your ride statistics. If, on the other hand, you have a block break outside the station on the track, and this, is block, this one hasn't left yet, and this one pulls up to that block outside the station, that will count against your ride stats. So, bear that in mind. Um, let's, yeah, we're going to go back to edit. And I'm going to start the test. First of all, I'm going to crank this up to, you know, we'll just crank it up to maximum, whatever. Um, and then we'll do our test here. Uh, you know what? First of all, I need to make sure that it's actually going to reach the lift hill. Uh, okay. So, here we go. We'll see what this does. Ah, nice, nice swig of tea while I wait. Ah, that's pretty nice, actually. I like that. All right. So let's uh, wait for this to get to the top. Right. There it is at the top. Comes around the corner, and away we go. Holy crap, look at that. Everybody's dead. <laughs> oh dear. All right. So now we've got that. It just takes one car to get the, uh, the the information that I want. So I want to look at vertical G's. So see, we're at 36 up here. So this actually needs to come down. Down here, we're at five. So this could technically go up a little bit. Now let's hit edit and see where we're at. Minus nine feet. So yeah, that could. This whole section here, I can lift up slightly. You know what? I'm going to turn off auto tunnel because that is choking things out. And I'm going to take this down to zero feet. Like that. Right now, I am going to do that. And I'm going to. I want to smooth that out just so I'm not killing people on the way down. Okay, now let's see, that's taking it up to one foot. So I am going to just very gently adjust it down slightly. Come on. What? Oh, that's minus. Oops. 
Uh, take that. There we go. All right, that's zero feet. Now, um, what was this one? The verticals. This one is at 30. Okay, so we've got minus, minus, minus. What I want to do is try and get a nice sustained zero G across here. So, and I think, to be quite honest, this. It's too poopy for that. So, I'm going to back this off. And I'm going to, you know, I'm going to turn on angle snap. Come on. Where's your problem? Thank you. That was kind of weird. It was uh, just like refusing to play. And then down. And then down to 45. And down again. Right. So what I'm going to do is run the test and see what I, what I get off of this. But I'm going to do it on maximum speed. And I'm going to do it without... Uh, without recording. Start the test. Right. That was pretty funny. Um, Alright, that's not bad. I mean... Actually, if I lengthen this out a little bit... No, screw that. Um... <laughs> What I want to do is just take all of this down slightly. Come on, play along. And then we will do another test and see what happens. Right. Yeah, that little flat bit there is a bit of a problem. So if I delete these and just come straight up and over without this elongated flat section here, that should do the trick. So... That can go away. Hit that one. Like that. That should... Do the trick quite nicely. Right. One more test. And we'll see what happens. Stop. Start. Maximum speed and play. Right. Now what have we got? Right, so we've got a zero G all the way through here now. Yeah, that's precisely what I want. This, on the other hand, not quite so much. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's that's not good. to be honest. Like that. Like that. And then like that. And I think what I'm going to do is do one more test like that. See what I get here. This is a little worrying, but I don't think it's going to be too problematic. Um, we'll see. But yeah, I'm going to see uh, what kind of G-forces I get off of there. And then we are going to call that 
it for the moment, I believe. Otherwise, this is just going to be insanely long of a video. If I try and knock out this whole thing in one shot, I mean... Come on. Did I stop? No. Whoops. Holy crap, look at him go. Wow. So off he goes. There he goes. Over that. Over there. Oh my god, look at it go. Alright, pause. Heat map. G load. Alright. Yeah, that's going to need adjusting. I don't want that much G right there. Now, again, remember, as I said, you know, when you're uh, going backwards underground and whatnot with a tunnel, make sure you use the undo instead of the delete, because the undo will fill in the tunnel for you, whereas delete one. Um, so we are going to. What was that anyway? Was that like. That wasn't 30 something, was it? Did I just put it back exactly as it was? Is that what I just did? Okay. And that's going to be that for the minute. Otherwise, uh, like I said, this is going to be going on for quite... Oh, that's the... I was like, what the hell is that? That's the ro roller coaster cars. Heading off into uh, orbit. Um, man, that's a heck of a difference, isn't it? But then I'm not doing that that whole rest thingy. You know, after that first big drop, you usually get that really big secondary hill that, that slows the car down and lets everyone catch their breath. None of that wussiness here. It's going to be white knuckle ride from start to finish. If your trousers are still unsoiled and white by the end of the ride, you get a free refund. But, I will continue this in the next episode. This is going to be interesting. I'm going to take him out this way a little more. Uh, maybe to this point here, actually. Or, actually, he's going to go up and turn around and come down. Because I kind of want to keep... No. He's going to go across this way, and he's going to do a loop around here and come back this way. So it's going to be kind of like an out and back, but across this section here. And then when he gets back to here, it's going to be all like twiddly diddly and knotty and weird before he gets back to the station. I think that's what I'm going to do. But for the minute, I'm going to call that it. Uh, I need to figure out what I'm going to do with the scenery here. And I need to finish off my winter one. But I wanted to get another big, big coaster going. So, it started.